Hi, I'm Joe and I want to show you my concrete block rehab project for the back porch. Just did my work with all those cans, removed debris, put it over here. And these things I don't like, these are the lentils for the back porch. Hold up a cement slab, you're supposed to put the center blocks underneath of these. And these balance the, uh, the pad on the top, the um, concrete uh, pad on the top of the concrete block back porch. So, you want to have these things in the corners when you build a porch. Now, I'm going to show the porch. The problem with the porch is it's uneven. It had the mantles in it, but the blocks were disintegrating on the side, so the whole top block or slab of the porch was. Uh, leaning towards uh, where the uh, concrete blocks uh, disintegrated and we had a water problem water erosion problem and the water erosion problem went between a fascia sheathing here which is uh, see that there that's uh, that's uh, metal lathing with stucco on top of it it's not even all filled in there now Scott said he put some uh, caulking in that. It's cracking right off to this edge here. I also put caulking on that. Now you get caulking over there. Okay, this is where the water erosion problem is right here. Right in the center of the porch. The water collects from the, the house here and it runs over to the center of the porch. You can put a drain in here, but it's not the right way to do it because it's going to soak up the, uh, the water in any way if it's not being pitched off. Drain can only handle so much. Well, these leaves will clog up really fast. So, uh, the right way to do the back porch would be to um, put some type of hard surface on it. Flagstones or flintstones or walkway blocks or tiles to uh, keep the cement centered right here and the cement would pitch off the water mostly this direction off the edge of the porch and we had steel lathing and stucco along here like we did here in the front of the porch okay. and we had to remove that because um, it was, the water was being stuck between uh, the uh, center blocks and the steel lathing and going into the uh, area around the uh, center box. And then this side of it, well, it still has the steel lathing on it. And uh, the contractor said, well, you don't have to take this off because this part hadn't been rotted. We well, can see the water line here anyway. Not that much water has been coming off there and getting in the sheathing but there's plenty of the, uh, the lathing board in the stucco right up until this point so I'll bet you some of those blocks underneath there are also corroded or rotted by water erosion and, uh, I don't really care about this particular job uh, some of this is done right they put some concrete right here to pitch off the water from the front of the house Okay, but uh, back there and in the center it's not. I put all that stuff up here because the, the structure was so unstable, the walls were crumbling off. That really should be removed right there because it's so uh, water damaged and it bowed out and it's got a big crack in it. And uh, this thing here, and where it's cracked to is right here. And that's where the uh, crack widens, you know. Okay. I didn't cut that off. Didn't check those blocks underneath of there. And I showed you yesterday that there's some uh, rotted blocks and he didn't remove that one at the top. I left the first course of blocks in there like that. And I could have jacked that up and then put the blocks in. Didn't put a lentil in there either trash them out and 
dumpster. We need the lintel right up there to support the, uh, the top of the porch. Concrete slab porch. Old Scottish concrete blocks in the walls. I don't even know if they go all the way to the top. Let's see now. This. Yeah. I just discovered something about this. It's never going to match. He's going to cut that off like he was cutting the other piece off in little pieces so I could throw them in the dumpster. He cut off with a sawzall and replaced the rotted blocks underneath it. Now look at this. Found this out today. It's all rotted away, man. Cinder blocks are rotted under here. Maybe some of these are better than they were on the other side, but this much has got a lentil in it to hold up the concrete slab. But from about here to the end, <laughs> I don't have any reinforced concrete uh, strip in there. It's just center blocks to support the weight of this porch. Yeah. So you could say, huh, my mom paid for it and she got ripped off. I didn't pay for it. <laughs> you want to do it this way, you can. <laughs> half and half, right? Have a halfway looking porch <laughs> on the outside. Probably have to cover this with uh, some siding or something to make it look like it's all one piece. And all symmetrical. Yeah, well. That's the difference between a hallway job and a halfway job. <laughs> some people want to do it halfway, and some people don't want to do it half all the way. Um, uh, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.